I thought as long as I'm willing to try and save lives, I will be motivated till the end. What began as an Eagle Scout project for this tall yet somewhat timid young man ended in building a network to save lives. Well, there it is. But there it is, hey, right look, there. We found it. White Bear Lake senior Zach Van Dyke wanted to do more than merely make a bench or birdhouse. He wanted to make a difference. Locating AEDs or automatic external defibrillators. Using GPS, the exact location is loaded into an app called PulsePoint AED. During a cardiac event where time is often the difference between life or death, the app locates the nearest device. Health teacher Dustin Holman says he often uses Zach as a resource in class and hopes the residents take advantage of this potentially life-saving tool. Having a kid like that that you can go to as a resource and also stays on top of everything is always a plus as a teacher. Over eight months, Zach approached 60 businesses and now has 100 locations contained in PulsePoint. Melissa Stearns, Director of Youth and Family Ministries at St. Stephen Lutheran Church, says with an aging population, it makes sense to be part of the program. We thought we were going to have to use it a couple weeks ago, and thank goodness we didn't, and it was everything turned out okay, but it was a little scary at first. In the end, Zach, who never saw himself as a leader, succeeded not only in building the system, but building his confidence. And as he prepares to graduate and begin 19 weeks of training for the National Guard, he says he's humbled by the help and humanity he's experienced along the way. I definitely feel that, unlike many people think, there is plenty of hope for the world. Um, and I just hope to, to keep striving with all the people that I connected with to a better world.